Hi and welcome back to my channel. My name is Honor Who You I. I'm so excited that I'm doing this particular video today and what I want to show you could be you might think it doesn't make sense or it's not necessary but believe me you need to know what this is and you need to know what the big guys in the industry are actually doing this. So in this video today I'm going to be teaching you how to create a profile photo that works directly from your mobile phone using the Canva app. So, but before that, I need to show you, I need to tell you why this is really, really important. Um, first, I'm going to go over to, I'm going to go to Instagram, and this is my Instagram account. And um, I want to just show you just um, through the story um, carousel that I have over here. You could see this one called Bammy Dot Brand. He's got an orange um, background. You could see this. Other one, um, Juju Branding, he is also having a, a green background. Morgenda is having a yellow background. This guy is having a black and white, and you can see the reason why his background is also gray. The same thing with this, you can also see Made by James is having the same thing. Uh, made by Studio JQ, the same thing. You can see Just Creative, The Future, um, uh, Chris Doe, um, Ellie's UX, and these people have their brand colors represent them directly from their profile photo and you do not want to know how this guy's account keeps growing okay now all you need to do there are a few things you need to learn before you go ahead to do this but I want to also tell you that if you have not subscribed if you have not followed me on Instagram I have a particular post where I created on Instagram uh, the post is talking about five profile um, picture tips that works on Instagram. Now I decided to create this particular video for you because I'm sure that um, you don't even have a profile photo that works. I'm sure you do not have a profile photo that works. I'm going to tell you how to do that directly here. Now one thing you notice is the moment someone comes over to your profile, social media account, the first thing they got to see is your profile photo and that is just after your name so that is the first thing people see when they view your profile on any social media account for instance uh, Facebook Instagram LinkedIn um, anywhere you actually want to try that this is where that's the first thing they see that's the next thing they want to see your profile photo and it takes only a cent a second for people to create a particular impression based on your profile photo so that is to say that in a split of a second, your photo could either um, convey that you are a trustworthy person or maybe and you also have competence or maybe that it doesn't. In as much as there are a whole lot of things you need to do and not do on your profile photo, like taking pictures with your family and pets or um, taking pictures, taking uh, old photographs and using them for your profile picture, or maybe you are having a... Um, a picture from a dating site. You do not want to do all of that. Taking pictures from Tinder, Match.com, and trying to put them on your social media account. You don't want to do that. So those are kind of do's and don'ts that you shouldn't do for your profile photo. And I'm also going to say that you should be able to get profile photos um, creatively done from a professional photographer if you can't do that with your mobile phone because you, sh you don't want to even use a selfie for these, right? So you, you don't want to take pictures where you are sitting in a car and then you've got a car belt or maybe you're trying to do a mirror in a gym. You don't want to do that. So go right now, go take a professional photo and come back right in this video and then we are going to start designing, just creating a professional photo for our social media account. So this is Canva and the first thing I'm going to do is I want to get my profile photo. I have already downloaded my profile photo. It's good, it's clear. The next thing we want to do is go to our browser and search for this particular browser here. It's called remove.bg. And then you want to upload the image. And this is the image I want to use. So I'm going to upload it. And uh, okay, the background is gone. So I'm going to download it. So after downloading, I need to go back to Canva and then add my brand color and see how this works. So to do this, what I'm going to do is I'm first going to uh, 
give this particular background here a color and it's going to be my brand color. I could use this or this, but this seems to be good for my brand for the profile photo because my picture is black and white. So with this, I will also click on add, go to illustration, I'm going to search for food and then food comes up and I'm going to use this one. I'm going to increase it, change the color to brown, give it a transparency. All right, then I'm going to add my image. So this is the image I just downloaded now. I'm going to add it here so it's from this position. Then I'm just going to increase it like so. So this way it's perfect and it's done and I have my brand representing me with my profile photo. So this is the easiest way to create a brand profile photo for your business. If you enjoy this, then I'll see you in the next video.